Hello folks and welcome to Deadwood. This is a map by Poor Boy Modding, Rooster's Gaming and GMG Joy. And what I'm going to be doing today is a small challenge where we're starting off with absolutely zero money. And our goal is to see how fast we can get to a million pounds, dollars, euros, whatever you want to call it. So obviously I can't do it on screen here, but besides me on my PC, I've got a timer ready to go. So I'll see how fast I can get to a million. However, I can get to a million very quickly within a matter of, what, seconds, minutes and that? By doing some cheaty stuff now, but I'm not going to be using any cheaty things like buy products and sell them on for profit. I'm not going to be using any generators, so things like windmills and that, I will not be using those. So, our productions, there will be limited, so I'll just see how fast I can get to a million by just doing farming. So, what I'm going to do is start the timer now. And as to see, we've got absolute zero money, so obviously the goal of the day is going to be contracts, so harvesting is going to be the matter of the agenda. So there we go, we're going to do some contracts. I'm going to do that one. And yeah, contracts are going very quickly, so I'll try to pick the more profitable one, so accept that. So we've got some contracts. So yeah, now it's let's do some contracts. So nine, nine, eleven, and seven. So seven is the first contract. I do have mods. Mods will be used not fairly, and that I'll say. Yeah, it won't be unrealistic or anything like that. So I don't think we're gonna get down the road with the combine as it is with the header on. So unfortunately, we have to use a header trader. So. Let's head to the field, and currently it's been a minute, and a header ain't on properly, so if it doesn't cause any issues for us, because that's the last thing I want to have is issues. There we go, the header tray is on. So yeah, 7 is a fertilizer contract, so let's head to 9 and 11, so that's going to be down this way. So alright, timer currently is 2 minutes and 15 seconds and counting. I think now we're going to be ready to detach that because I do have some tricks now. I can use to get some quick money coming in. Also, I may be utilizing some of these products here. So, I apologize there. A little hiccup there. So, I'm just going to reset the header trader if I can. There we go. Header trader's been reset. Because yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing is things like that, I'm just going to just quickly go bang bang, get everything done as much as I can. Unfortunately, we've got zero money at the moment, so really I should have borrowed the second combine because yeah, that would be more useful for us. And dang it, we can't get any canoe straw because yeah, six uh, miles an hour doing these fields. Yeah, I should have had the second field. Actually, is there a way to do... Because I can't, again, I can't even hire workers now, because I've got absolute zero money, so... At the moment, I am just faffing around. Try to get to the right menu contracts. Any other big pain contracts? Corn. Wheat. I think, you know what? I'm going to compromise ourselves here and just say, yeah, we'll do that one. Because, yeah, corn, that can wait. So, yeah, now... Oh, dang it. Oh, because, yeah, I was thinking it'll sell some stuff off. But, no, we can't because we've got a new money for workers. Actually, what I'm going to do is... Because I want to have a million in our bank account. So, what I want to do is something a bit different here so what I'm going to do is go to our finances because yeah the goal is to have a million in the bank account we are on normal economy settings actually that I will double check so I want to take out as much money as possible because I think actually this could be the way to go so I've wasted current timer is 4 minutes and 40 seconds now so half a mil because, yeah, I think as well, rules is, I'm not going to use stupid working bits. Things like, 
Uh, things like with the Colossus, so things like the 13.8 meter ones, not too bad. But 55 miles an hour top speeds, I'm not going to be using those, so I am going to be restricting myself on what I can use. So, so yes, please, I want to borrow that. The Colossus Harvester, sure, maybe, or don't use something else. I think 15,000 litres. Yep, yeah. unrealistic, it's a new. Deadwood X Nop. Capacity wise. No, I don't, again, I don't want unrealistic in that, so. Thinking you know what, we'll go with the X9 by on the map in that, so. There we go. Also, traders in that. Because, yeah, the whole f purpose behind this challenge, just speaking, yeah, you know, get unrealistic stuff in that, all all lovely jubbly in that. But yeah, 50k, ugh. I am playing it very loose in terms of what I can get away with here, so... No, I think I'm going to be fair here. So yeah, I want... A couple of those, so... One, two of those. Yeah, cause that's going to be the way to go. Rather than borrowing equipment from contracts, again, I should have done this from the start off with, but... Hey, I've not planned this out. I planned, like, you know, mods to download in that. Because I had a different route I was going to plan to go with here, but... This will work out very well for us, so... Actually, we've got, since we've got other combine, let's just use it, so... You are going to be going on to the field, so yeah, currently it is 6 minute and 55 seconds, so... So yeah, let me just get things set up here. Oop. Yeah, blocking traffic. Because yeah, things like productions I can do because I've done a... I think it was like a two hour plus video on this. I'll leave it in the description down below next. And in the end cards, but... There is a way to get a lot of money very quickly on this map. And that's by using some productions. And I cannot remember for my life on what these productions were, because there are 23 OP productions on this map. I'm not sure if I included the BJ when I did the initial video on it. But yeah, again, feel free to check out, because I think it's actually my third most watched video on my channel's history. Like, when I saw that video taken off in the algorithm, I was like, fucking hell, nice. So yeah, I think currently it's got 4,400 views, so if I can get that to 5,000 views before FS25 comes out next month, that would be nice, but yeah, the reason I did views like that is because, again, it's maps like this where it's absolutely stunning, so, so you can get strong, fair enough. And I do have a one more combine. So yeah, we'll use a U. Yeah, at the moment it's just pure franticness, so what I'm going to do is get these contracts done, and I'll see you folks in a few moments, or a few seconds here, in your time when we're done, but again, timer's still going, timer ain't going to stop for no man. Yeah, it's a slightly smaller header than that by the seams, but at the moment anything is better than nothing, so yep, yeah, I'll see you folks once we're done with these contracts. That's one thing it's going for, and I may do other videos on it, like where I try to improve myself, not myself, my timing that, because yeah, currently it's 9 minutes, and to be fair, I think we should have made more progress, but again, I'm not using unrealistic stuff. Actually, I do have an idea for lumber in that, because I do have a mod called the Industrial Sawmill installed in that. Oh, bloody hell, traffic. But yeah, so, let me just get this, <laughs> let me get these contracts done, and then I'll see where we stand afterwards once we're done here. So, a quick update, it has been 1 hour and 24 minutes and 30 seconds since we first started, and yeah... 
I think in doing this may not be the fastest way overall to get a million. But yeah, so what we're gonna do is contracts completed. There we go. But yeah, so field one, we're not gonna be able to well we are, we are able to, but I am not gonna complete that contract because I have at least the forest pickup and the T four four E Horse Pack Auger Train that so the Auger Wagon as part of the T four four E multi horse pack. 120,000 litres, and that is just the base capacity. There's no, you know, unrealisticness to it, or at least unrealistic configuration. So I know, I know I'm playing it very loose with the rules here, but. So yeah, field 1. So yeah, we can complete fields 9 and 11. And yeah, I think what I'll do is. Except field 10. Get the horse on that field. Okay, yeah, can't do canoe straw, didn't think so. But yeah, so. Yeah, it's 1 hour 26 now, and. Yeah. How much have we actually earned so far? So if we look at our finances, we have earned. 16,000 plus 18,000 plus 50,000, so. 70,000 or so in what, an hour and a half almost, so... Yeah, I don't think this is the best option for us, and I am stuck somehow. There we go. But yeah, what I've got done is I've purchased Field 8, because I've got an idea where we can make that core into a silage, and then, yeah, we can get a facility down, bunk silo, or a production. And from that... We can get some TMR, not TMR, some silage being produced. But yeah, also Seasons is off. I have turned it off as part of the challenge and that, so... Because yeah, we know we can have Seasons on and that is okay, but... I think I am not utilising on what is the actual best way to get money, and that is using trees and that, so... Because yeah, I know everyone hates logging and that, but... Logging is a good way to get a lot of money very fast. Especially if you're using wood chips or other productions and that, so... See, so yeah, I think that's what we should be utilising, is the productions, the wood chips and that. Actually, I'm not sure if I've got the mod particularly to wood chip them. No, me, I probably haven't. No, I haven't got the, the devourer, so I'll get that added in a sec. And that's, that's part of Deadwood and that, there is a mulcher in that, in a way. Not a mulcher in that, but a tree devourer in that, so snow plow, nope. Uh, just having a look, pulp in that, flat beds in that, nope. But yeah, again, saying, actually go back to these Deadwood mods and that. There's nothing to say I can't use on these, are part of the map and that. Yeah, but again, that's, it's getting to the realm of unrealistic speeds and that, so... I may purchase, purchase or at least set equipment, but keep it, restrict myself, but then again, would you folks believe me if I keep it to, you know, 10, 50 miles an hour like we're doing at the moment? Thinking yeah, 50 miles an hour and that is a good speed and that. So yeah, I do have mods that let us go up to these speeds when harvesting and that. But yeah, specifically haven't selected them yet, but I think yeah, it's so that getting to an hour and twenty-nine minutes now, so but yeah, let me just finish off doing these and then we'll reconvene afterwards once we're done with this. Because, yeah, thinking, yes, yeah, an hour and a half now almost, and making 70 grand. I'm going to be here all day, otherwise. So, yeah, so I'm to change things up a notch, and that. Contracts, pharmacy in general, there are a good way to make money. Now, again, I'm not bashing contract work. Because, yeah, they are a good way to get money, especially when you do contracts like this, where you get straw. Because, yeah, usually you're not able to pick up straw on consoles, at least. I know there's PC mods that let you 
pick out straw from fields that aren't yours. However, using the devourer here, not the devourer, um, the forest pickup, this will let you pick up straw from the fields without having to own the fields net. See, that is a good way to get cracking on. But yeah, I think in we should get to the best way to make money in general, which is wood chips and may silage. Or grass silage in general. Yes, I know that's a lot of seamy, seamy, seamy work, but at the end of the day, it is a fast way to get money now. And things we're doing at the moment, we're not doing the most profitable crops. Things like soybeans are a good way to make money, cotton's a good way to make money in that. But yeah, at the end of the day, it is what it is. But anyway, so let me go and get this finished off. And then I'll see you folks once we get the rest of this sold, and then we get this contract completed. And then actually it's time to actually speed up this challenge a bit, because yeah, hour and a half. I'm not going to be able to beat, beat a goal, or I don't have a goal in set, but I know this is going to be very beatable. Because yeah, an hour and a half, I could literally just plant grass and fast forward time. I think that's what I'll do on attempt 2 in the upcoming video. Also, I think I'll just do a video on logging in general. I think, yeah, this video will be just farming. The next one would be, you know, logging. And then, yeah, go from there and such. But, yeah, so that is done. Worker is always filled on field 10. And I'll see you folk in a second. Alrighty then, so it is an hour and 49 minutes and 22 seconds, and yeah, so so far we've earned 106 grand. We were getting about 7,000 years per load from this contract and that, so we got 740, 21 plus 3 grand, so that's 24 grand. I have completed that other contract, which including that lease and fees and that, was about 8 grand, so if you're doing. Ah, shit. Oh no, I fucked up because I used that trailer for that contract. And I had all the fucking uh, canola in, so. Oh, how much of a penalty fee? Fuck. That is an absolute cock. Do I say get the 35 grand back in that? I think in the grand scale of things, that ain't going to matter too much in that. So. Okay, lesson learned. Don't overcomplicate things by doing ship a contract and that so now what I want to do is do the forge harvesting, discharge speed, I'll we'll just keep everything standard and that so but rather than you know having the basic navy harvest moon blue colours let's go with a nice fluoro green yeah, I can't believe I literally fucked up on that. I didn't even realise it until I started recording, so... Uh, it is what it is, and that. So, there we go. At least that for 15 grand. Let's do a... Want a Forge Harvester header and that, so... I'll just quickly have a look, see what the biggest one I got. I know there's a 50 meter one mod. But I don't think that's going to be really useful for us, so... 9 meters at 12 miles an hour? Yes, please, because. Yeah, these are unrealistic ones, isn't that? Let's see a forage in that. And yes, yeah, so looking at the other ones, that. Yeah, the Titan Forage that is 9 meters at 10 miles an hour, so. What was that someone there? And yeah, basic game ones are 9 meters at 6, so. Let's go with this one. Okay, yes, technically it's slightly unrealistic now because it's twice the base game speed, but maybe I'll do a vanilla version whilst I try to do this, but using only va vanilla stuff in that. So, I've got a couple of videos already, ideas in that. So, now I want Sage Additive. And I don't have the Sage Additive drum. But do I have anything that can help us with this? Because I really don't want to use stupid the pump additive and that. Oh, fuck. So, alright, fine, fine. Here's what it is and that. So, side additive, three grand. 
the most worthless thing to have in FS that is. That is absolutely stupid. Yes, there are mods now, and I do have these mods downloaded and installed in that. But I shouldn't have them with me at the moment. In oh, crap. Ah, wait a minute. What's in this one here? No, okay, nothing's in that one. Fair enough. Let's go and reset the trailer. So, currently it is an hour and 53. And yeah, so. Why is that? Oh, don't say I got automatic engine. Turn that off, please. So, go to our settings and that. I saw that one here. Automatic engine start. And yes, I think I won't stop going breaking just the automatic engine I went off, so Alright, so it is an hour and fifty three minutes and fifty seconds. We did earn about hundred and X grand. Hundred and six plus some um, contracts, but then that penalty. Three or five grand down the drain, so I've already fucked up on that, so I don't think it's going to re impact it now, because. Yeah. Okay, unfold the pipe. Ah, wait a minute, no, it's this one here, so. Unfold you. See, so it's time to get the slice from that, so. I'm going to be using a production for this, because. Heck, am I waiting for it to ferment in that, so. Where is it to? No, I don't want Deadwood stuff. Do you have that one, the custom? There we go. So, yeah, gone and got that quickly installed. So, there it is. That's why I want the custom from Entra Silo. So, I'm thinking input is here, outputs on the road. So, I think I'll be a bit cheeky with this. Something like that. Uh, jumping actually looks quite well, it does. You know, then to the roads. Defensing that actually looks quite good, actually. So, now we are foraging. So, yeah, now it's time to make the real bucks. Because, yeah, what? Almost hour and 55, and we earned. Even if you included the profits we get from the crop and that. Yeah, it wasn't too much to be fair on that. I think we'll get quite a bit of money from this, so what I'm going to do is continue on with this. Because, yeah, if we look at our productions, and I did notice by accident, ooh, more contracts. Thank you very much. Fertilizing, yes. Cultivating, thinking actually these ones can be quite profitable now, so. Yes, and yes. I'm not going to borrow their equipment. Because, yeah, cultivators and disc arrows. I do have mods for these, so... Uh, not those ones. Disc arrows, I think they're under. So, we have a look. Plenty of options, so... 12 meters at 12 miles an hour, 10 meters at... So, yeah, I think... Ooh, 620 horsepower. Yeah, nope. 9.8 at 11. If you can actually. These ones here. If you can. You know what? Let's get a couple of these. And yeah, oh, look at that. I've got two tractors already. So, frozen, I'll do separately in that. So, I'm going to get you hooked up and ready on field 9. So that worker is off and ready to go on field 9. Now I'll get this one on field 10. There we go. Workers in the way. We are foraging. And actually, I think, you know what? I'm going to have a second forager, I think. See, so yeah, if I use that one. Nope, not doing unrestricted capacities in that, so keep it standard. Also, it is a little bit cheaper in that, so 
That is a bonus. Okay, yeah, I forgot to install the cheap storage additive in that, so... Yeah, this is going to really start biting into our potential profits, because... Yeah, six grand may not seem much, but it does add up over time, so... But yeah, I know you get your money back, so... I don't know why I'm whining too much, but... I'm just saying... But yeah, so we'll get you filled up. There we go, that is that all filled up, ready to go. Yeah, could have done a second loop, but I'm not going to. So yeah, I think what I'm going to do after us once this field is harvested is do grass. And then, yeah, I think we'll cut it, bait it, because yeah, we get size bells. Or do we just forge it? I think foraging may be the better option for us. So yeah, I'm going to take over with this one, because at least then... We don't have any issues with it at the end once it's filled up. So yeah, currently time-wise on the stopwatch, it is two hours and two minutes and twenty-two seconds. So yeah, now this is where we start putting pedal to the metal because yeah, first two hours we earned one hundred ten grand potentially in that minus the fuck up in that. So yeah. This is the way to make money now, is by doing signage, because yeah, signage is the best money maker to go. But yeah, with some realistic mods and that, and maybe quote unquote, or at least the basic mods and that, some fermented silos with some very unique speeds and that. But yeah, ignore these productions, I have started this on new farm remotes, so... Yeah, but I didn't realise I was going to get this and that, so my apologies there. But yeah, so we don't get as processed because it is we'll process it at 480,000 a month. We do get some lossage, but overall it is worth it. So yeah, it gets feel done, and I'll see you folks once we're done this. Everything we'll get will be saved because yeah, we'll sell it over winter and that because we should have another cut potentially of grass now. So if we say it's August now. We plant in this month, so that'll be September, October, November, December. So yeah, potential free cuts before we sell everything in February Nat. But yeah, of course that involves drilling that, you know, getting crops into the ground. So we're gonna need a direct drill. And should water over here. Go to should I perhaps do that? Okay, let's go and put you in. So now that's on the way. So yeah, now we're going to get a lot of sides from this. If we need to, we'll get a side to put down, but I don't think we should need one. But yeah, so I've waffled along enough now. Let me get this done, and I'll see you folks afterwards. Once I am done with sideage. So yeah, contract 9%, or oh sorry, 10% of field 9. That is what I like to see. There we go. And alright, so we have just crossed the 5 hour mark. I thought, bring it all back in together, so... We are done with the silage work, obviously. That was done a while ago. We spent like the last hour or so just doing contracts and that, especially the fertilizing contracts, because, yeah, did use a little exploit, so we're going to get a lot more money from the silage contract, not silage, fertilizing contract. So, at the moment, we're at 400 grand, so I think, yeah, 5 hour mark now, so it should be enough now. So, what I'm going to do. Is so, yeah. I've got a lot of equipment leased out, so I think it's time to return some of these at the least for now. Also, I do have grass rates to go, but I think we can get enough money from the silage possibly because, yeah, at the moment we're at 400 grand, but also we've still got land we can sell, so 
If we sell that, that would be 669 grand in total. We're going to have about 900,000 litres of silage. So, how much is silage worth? So, if I go down to our economy settings, silage is worth. Uh, I don't think we're just going to have quite enough. So, I think what I'll do is. Yep, I think I'll just do a bit of silage again. So, what I'm going to do is uh, go to my mods. Uh, where's the liquid barrels? Do I have that installed? H I J K L. No, I don't have it installed. Dang it. I thought I did, so. Alright, you know what? Fine. Because, yeah, it's five hours now. And, yeah, so let's go and purchase some liquid fertilizer. Even though I don't know why, because I do have a bunch of solid fertilizer. But, yeah, so I've gone and lease a bar of some equipment, obviously. In time since we last fully seen each other, just because there's been, what, a couple of days since I've done the last segment. Like last proper segment on camera where I chat for a bit, so I'm just gonna fill this up. And yeah, so currently it's half one. I think yeah, that's what that should be enough because I did. Oh, what did I do? Yeah, I said the field eight. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm really hoping we can just you know, get this all done because yeah, I think five hours to a meal. It's reasonable in that. Obviously, a lot of times we faffed around doing contracts and that. The first first line of contracts has definitely been worth it, at least. But yeah, I think I'm just going to skip through all this. Oh, frickin' come on. <laughs> oh man, this is so slow. There we go. See, so yeah, I'm thinking what we'll do is just get us all drilled. Again, obviously the goal of this is... What did I stop there? The goal is get to a mill by just doing farming. So this is going to be this video. The next video is going to be a login. And then using fast farming. So fast farming and unrealistic mods and that. Obviously, both of those is going to be a lot quicker because... Yeah, the login is just going to be using... What? One piece, actually no, technically three pieces of equipment. Devour, trader, and a tractor. So that will be done very quickly. Obviously fast farming in that, so... Things like, you know, 50 meter working with equipment in that. So things like doing... Again, silage is the way to go, but I think for that video, using fast farming in that, unrealistic equipment, thinking, you know what, possibly in the realms of maybe... Actually, I think it's soybeans or potatoes. What's the besides from like obviously grass silage now? What's the most viable crop? I think it's I know normal crop is soybeans. But also, you do have potatoes now because I do have some of these mods installed for this because I didn't know exactly how to go down. So looking at the colossus and that. So yeah, potatoes and that. Got a bit diverted there because yeah, I was thinking, you know, doing extra work and that, but I'm thinking actually, we don't need any of that. So, yeah, currently in August, so we get a bunch in October, I think. Because, yeah, it's 60 months for grass grow. I don't have seasons on, so yeah, currently it's five hours and eight minutes. So, yeah, let me just get this done and I'll see you folks once we're done with the drilling. So, right, that is grass drilled and yeah. We have some leftover products, so what I'm going to do is make a quick buck or two by selling our items. Are we going to be able to sell the liquids? Don't think we will sell the liquids, unfortunately, so it is what it is. So you want to leave that there. That is going to get returned because, yeah, all we need now is the tractor and the trader. So I'm going to cheeky reset that. Time-wise, at the moment, we are at 5 hours and 42 minutes, so, so far, not so bad, and, yeah, really, it's just a case of getting everything mowed and that, so, what I've gone and done is, I spent 50 grand on purchasing this area over here, because I need to empty that silo, because I want to sell all the silage in, well, it won't be one go, because we're doing normal equipment, so, 
Hehe, <laughs> yep, some of the arts will do just fine. And yeah, so we need to clear some space in the production because we have a look. So yeah, ignore these productions, we haven't not used those at all. So yeah, we're at maximum capacity in our hand. Yeah, well, we're going to have more grass going in. And yeah, we can be a bit cheeky with, you know, uh, by using, uh, what's it? Uh, the tether out to get some silage, or sorry, uh, get a tether out and get some hay out on the way, but we can really, all we're just going to do is, oh yeah, I'm forgetting to unfold this. Yeah, I think we're just going to do the grass, get clipped with a forge wagon, I think. I think that's going to be the way to go, unless we can do a forge pickup in that, so. Yeah, that's filled up, because whilst that's filled up, let's have a look at some of our options, because standard. That can do grass, apparently. Yeah, I am getting to the realms of pushing the limits here, so. Because, you know, once something I'll be able to pick up the grass, I like that. 6.2 meters at 9 miles an hour. That saves us having to then mow and then collect it with a forged pickup in our forged wagon. That collects the grass off the ground. I am tempted to use a mod, so obviously it'll be standard, yes. 9 meters at 12 miles an hour. It says grass and that, so really should be able to mow the grass then. Unless I go to for yeah, forge harvesters completely and mower nets. Tied to mirror. What's the difference in the two? So, thinking, actually, what well, I think if we just do that, use the grass mirror net. Yeah, it needs to be a bit careful because I don't want to start wasting money on just unnecessary things. Now, things like silos and that, productions like that, could be all sold. So, I think for now, that is fine. But yeah, I think the longest part now is going to take is the transport of the silage and sell it. So, obviously it's going to peak in around uh, December, February that time. So, that is underway. I'll start fast forwarding the time to get the rest of that process. So, oh, I need to at least do one more load. Oh, I think I've made a mistake because yeah, I'm starting to fill these up now, really. I was going to say that sell. How much can we get from that? So fast forward time. And yeah, as I expected. So we're still going to need a bit more money. So <clears throat> actually, I want to see if I can put this back in. Yeah, this is very slow at reversing. Because it does get, it is a real weight in that. But yeah, it just has a slightly larger capacity to capacity than normal. But yeah, I think foraging is going to be the way to go. There you go. Yeah, also, yeah, I did put a seat trigger in. Obviously, the Deadwood chair. Also, big hit, you know, just 10 bucks. And boom, seat trigger that. Seat in the chair, seat in the field. Who needs a roof over your head for a couple of months? And yeah, I don't think that's going to go in, right? New, no. so dang it. Fair enough. Bring the yogurt in. I'm just going to fill this up and then, yeah, start fast forwarding time. Because, yeah, currently, time wise, it is 4 hours and 49 minutes. So, yeah, 5 hours and 49 minutes. So, yeah, need to get cracking on. So, one more sleep. And then boom. Yeah, I know, time wise. Yeah, again, as I mentioned, this could be done quicker if I start waffling on. I just did like, the contracts, forget about them, just do size, go boom, boom, boom. Like the foraging, that makes Aussie sense in that. See, so, yeah, grass is ready to harvest. Actually, we can. Because it can grow to a second stage in that. And yeah, might as well now, because we're not running seasons in that. As long as it stops raining, that's all that matters. Yeah, I don't think we get us under six hours, but under seven hours, yeah, I think it's possible now, so. 
There we go. Yeah, I forgot, didn't put lime down, but you know what? That I am not fussed with at all. So, yeah, what do I want? I want the Forge Harvester. Just standard, as it is. And then, yeah, we want the Forge Pickup, and now the Forge... What's the largest one? I am going to take Gamble, so... Yeah, Titan Forger. Unrealistic, that means it could do the grass, but I don't know. I want the mower, so... Guessing that one. I might as well just lease a, another auto wagon since I have one filled up with uh, silage at the moment. So, boom, there we go. That is 21 grand. But yeah, now is the sort of important thing of have I wasted my money? Yeah, you know, could just done, you know, a mower and that. We've got the mowers ready to go and that. But yeah, I think you can also, slow down if we do have some still, so. Go and fill that up and then get us into the field. And the moment the truth is, we have not wasted our money, so. Helps if you actually unfold your the wagon, so that means that you can actually get some stuff out. Have we lost product? Hopefully not, but yeah, so now we are mowing at 6, oh sorry, not 6, 12 miles an hour, 6 meter wide. Yep, yeah, we do have a wider mower, the mower can go faster, obviously, but... Because yeah, we've got the mower in that, so... I could do 10 meters at 13 miles an hour. However, we got the added benefit of, you know, using the side charitive. Don't hit the play fence. Don't need to be cheap now. I can get away with, you know, just doing a little bit. So, really, since we've already got the... My thinking now is, we've already got this on the way. If I can get myself on a worker, I'm always doing a couple of headlands at least, then... Yeah, do a couple of headlands so the worker doesn't have any issues with turning around. Maybe two or three headlands. Definitely at least two now for the worker to be able to turn around in that. And then, yeah, we have to work our way on that. Then we can start just, you know, crack on as we normally do that. Uh, these fences. Thank you, Brucey, and probably Modding, for letting us be able to remove these fences. Let's just get the base, so... Yeah, it's going to take a bit of time to do. Obviously, we've got a large grass field here. So, yeah, really, what we're going to do is keep it set to sell on that. Actually, what? Thinking, not screw it, so we're just going to do that. Actually, can we sell the silo with the silage in it? I don't know what. May not be the most valuable now, but you know what? Screw it. So let's go sell the silage. I'm going to let the worker continue on its way. Just so that at least we have some money coming in. Because then also, yeah, we're in November, so we can still get another cut in February for that growth for three months. And then, yeah, so if we do get in this, this session, we should be able to get the money in this session, so... Because, yeah, all we need is what? We've got 300 grand locked up in the fields now, at the moment, so... That uh, is 823 grand, so all we need now is another 177 grand-ish, give or take, so... That means, in terms of silage and that, we're going to need at least another 600 or so thousand a year, so... I think it's doable now. that, so... Five of those with the Forge Harvester, and that, that is it, pretty much, so... I think for the final push now, the video's gone on for long enough, I think, and I'll be doing everything in those segments, so... I'm just going to go to Team 1. Get everything done, get everything sold as I'm going along. And I'll stop the timer or bring you folks back after I'm about to start the timer as we hit 1 million in what, 7 hours? So, yeah, currently it's 5 hours and 55 minutes. So, yeah, let me get this done and I'll see you folks later on. And there we go. I think technically we could actually already hit the mile mark now of in 1 million. 
but yeah, I just want to do it properly, you know, so let's keep on fast forwarding time. So yeah, that is everything. So everything sold, so yeah, at 800 grand, but remember, we've still got the fields in that, so dang it, sell these items in that, so. This is awkward. I thought I had the challenge wrapped up in that, you know. Six hours, 40 minutes to get milk by just farming in that. I thought, yes. Not too bad. So, yeah, let's go turn that off a sec so I can actually speak and hear. And, yeah, so we had a little oopsie of where, yeah, we had 1.1 mil in the bank account. But one thing I didn't take into consideration was the loan, the half a mil loan. So unfortunately, I didn't save the game, I didn't. I thought, yep, you know what's done, all done, dusted in that. Leave the game, did bother saving it. Why, I did, do not know. And yeah, as I was setting up my login version of this, now nah, getting things, not much set up now, nah, just do a bit of quick research now nah, on land prices and planning out strategies and nah, that ahead of time. Like for this one where it's been just a case of doing it as I'm going along. So yeah, I had to, get things set up but yeah money's gone down that's because I want to make sure I get this challenge smashed out now so I'll go and purchase three new fields create two big gold fields so what was 10 and 56 there together and 58 and 59 so because that time we got what about 400 grand I think it was inside the internet 300 grand 400 grand so at the moment time wise it is Nine hours, three minutes, and forty seconds. So, yeah, that's a couple of hours we've spent, you know, just getting things ready and all of that. So, workers going to be on the way on that. And yeah, so the what we did last time seemed okay. However, we was just it was taking too long, I think, to be honest with the uh, set we had going. So. I'm going to do by the mowers and the forest wagon. I think the forest wagon idea is really good. Can do it at what, 15 miles an hour? I think 40 miles an hour. So we keep in tow with the mowers and that. So obviously that was with the one mower last time. This time we're going to have two. So it's going to be a bit behind, you know, getting things done, getting things all catched up and that. But yeah, so we're just going to do one field at a time. Do this section here, field seven and eight. And then, yeah, we'll do 10 and the little extra bit at the end. But yes, yeah, so I did go get some grass and that. And that was purely from all the grass cut around field 7. Bit of bottom field 8, I think. And that section by our plot 56 by between 10 and the factories and that. So this bit here, that was, yeah, about half a mil. So yeah, always half a mil, give or take. So as you get a 5% loss in silage and that, so yeah, this thing didn't take us too long, maybe what, an hour or so to get this all done, so because yeah, what I'm going to do is just keep on going along, so once I, I am happy, I'll get a fur tractor, I'll get a forage wagon out, and then uh, yeah, I'll get chasing on, workers can be continuing on mowing, because with two workers doing this, yeah, can get us done by 10 hours. So I felt I had ideas for the fun now, now you know, hour one, then they look like going across, and hour ten, and funny enough, it's going to take us ten hours to get to a meal. Which, to be fair, I think, just farming, you know, we're just doing silage and that. Silage, also, yeah, I thought we got a bit of crop in that cell as well, don't we, in that, because I did harvest till ten, I did. That was the canola, and I think canola is at its peak at the moment. Yeah, have a quick look at that. Canola. Ah, oh, dang it, it peaked in November. But we're still getting a good price for it now, so. Actually, we've done, done the worst bit, so. Oh, a bit of lag spike there. Let's get this aligned. Yes, please. Come on, we own this field. Come on, fuck's sake. Oh yeah, to be fair, I have got a bit carried away with, you know, extending the boundaries and that. 
So yeah, I'm actually going to do it. Thank you very much. So yeah, I'll to these well, one more tractor on that. So again, I think what's cost us that in this challenge it has definitely been the equipment in that. So uh, what's that one? Two two five. I think you know what, let's go straight to the larger tractors. Because you yeah, don't need anything massive now. I think we've got a cheap one, don't we, in that? There we go, this one here, the Clausarian. Yeah, get a bit of extra horsepower, please. Five grand. Because, yeah, if we look at our finances at the moment, so these and that, overall, that's been the biggest expense. Fortunately, has not come up at the moment, that's because we've just gone over couple of months ahead but I think it's something like uh, 260 grand in leasing fees and that so yeah that's what's hit hurt us the most so oh yeah that's over because I did sell a little bit of seed in that, that I had left over after drilling so yeah I've got a silo set up down <laughs> not for that janky steering See, I think this would be good with the forge wagon. But yeah, so yeah, I've got slightly woods over there. And overall, these added prices, these are 3, 550, 600 grand. So all we need is 400 grand. So I think that's I, yeah, we earned what? Again, sorry to say that, how much I earned that side because I completely forgot. I think it's about, yeah, 300 grand. So technically, I could have got away with this. Quicker than that, possibly if I just do two lots of grass cutting in that, rather than you know doing spending what two hours in that, doing field extensions, plowing, making cock ups and that with that. But yeah, honestly, I don't know. I think if I was going to do this again, if it's silage contracts, yes. Not silage contracts, actually, yeah, if it's silage hay con like silage bean contracts, yes. If it's fertilizer contracts, definitely yes, because you can use the trick of using buy cheap fertilizer, fertilizer using the farm supply package, and then yeah, go and get that sold. But anyway, so canola, best price, grocery marts, grain mill. Actually, actually, it's quite good over here. And yeah, this is why I don't like the class area and that. It's yeah, because we're the hitch is so far into the tractor that that, so can't do a can't do a tight U-turn. That's why I did these is to do some of the plowing in that, and then yeah, quickly changed it up because yeah, where it's catching on that hitch and that as you're doing a full crank turn. Yeah, that's not ideal. So, anyways, thirty-seven thousand liters of canola. So yeah, at least like I can say we have done some harvesting. Yeah, okay, not a lot of harvesting at all. And again, maybe if I just did soybeans and that a little over over and over again, possibly now nah, being quicker now. Nah. But yeah, actually, yeah, please some ideas down below. What would you do now? Because yeah, it's gonna be about ten hours, I think. There we go. So yeah, 42 grand for that, so yeah. Workers, how are they doing? Not too bad at the moment, so... Yeah, I'll go to get cracking up with this. Oh yeah, currently it's 9 hours, 10 minutes and 50 seconds, so yeah. I'll see what in... An hour or so? Hopefully this actually gets done in before 10 hours, but yeah. I am waffling along, again, content created. Contain is going to cost us a lot, so yeah, let me get this done, and I'll see you folks as we'll wrap things up, because yeah, this video has been going on for long enough, I think, so I'm just saying now you're 10 hours of work, and maybe half an hour or so of recording, hour of recording, try to get it all edited down, but yeah, so lag spikes and that, and I'll see you folks in seconds. And alright, we have gone way over, so yeah, time to sell everything, so, sell, sell, and sell, and now that is us almost at a million. Not including selling this main field here, so let's quickly go and get our 
last bit of uh, what's it? Silage fermented. There we go. One mil. So that is done. So officially we're at a mil and yeah, it is absolutely dark. So what I'm gonna do is one remember some timer. Well just this creeped up to 9.56. 9 hours and 56, 56 minutes and 1.96 seconds. But yeah, let's say just bang on one, 9.56 now. I think that is fair enough, so... Yeah, grass is growing again, but I do not care. Anyways, that is the challenge done. So, so yeah, definitely this time we're at 1 mil. And yeah, bank account says otherwise. Yep. 800 grand got in products and yeah leasing was a big thing but anyway so that is that 9 hours and 56 minutes definitely this chance to be done at least an hour or two quicker minimum I'm going to think of a couple of optimizations I can do one just start doing the size straight away because yeah thinking yeah if I start off with what was it half a mil with the loans think yeah get those two fields done get the main size done then get this all mowed out. Forget about doing contracts and unless it's fertilizing contracts, then yes. But only really, okay, I was pushing the limits with the rules and that, with the size, not size, the cheap bags of fertilizer, but that is a mod and that, so it's mod and I just used it as it is, didn't add anything unrealistic to it. But anyway, so yeah, I think in definitely get sub eight hours of this. I think sub eight hours from zero to a million by just farming. No, okay, yes, the factory was a production, but I was gonna use a bunker silo and that. So yeah, okay, just farming. I'm playing the very loose in that. So it's what it is. Now, you know, the field of need for opinion is down below. But yeah, next time we're gonna be doing logging. So currently it is. 10 o'clock, no crap, 11 o'clock, dang it. <laughs> so, yeah, I need to go to bed now. Get, well, get up at work at 4 in the morning. So, yeah, 5 hours, get some sleep in that for work. Then, yeah, got a long day at work. So, yeah, this video will be up hopefully Monday afternoon. That's Monday evening ish, or well, Monday evening. If not, it'll be up Tuesday, depending on if you get any mods of that on Monday. And that, but, anyways, as always, hope you found this helpful. And that, and yeah, so next time we're going to be doing login. Also, I'm really sticking out just to see how far you can get with just doing stupid equipment. So, things like anything I'll bottleneck with fast farming with drilling that on console is going to be the drills and that because I think yeah, I got a couple of them here. Things like yeah, unrealistic 3 miles an hour. I think yeah, that's even the max speed we can do, even if you use the Deadwood ones. They're 3 miles an hour, so. Oh yeah, I've got a couple of ideas for doing Unreal Stick. But yeah, login as a little sneak peek on that. It's going to be using the Devourer and that, so... And I'll be playing on the login version of this map, where instead of having all these lush little fields, it's going to be all just trees and that, so hopefully I don't have a game crash in that. But yeah, I think doing the wood chips that strategy, that's going to take less than an hour or so. Yeah, I don't think that's going to be a major issue for us. But you can tell how much you've gone over by because we sell this field. Oh, wait a minute. What have I still got here? Ah, wait a minute. The side of wood and that, so. Oh, yeah, dang. I can't sell it now because I've got these productions and that, so can't sell that one. But yeah, even just sell that one. So 1.355 mil. 1.4 mil we have, so yeah, I've gone way over in that, so yeah, definitely optimization is needed, but anyways, but yeah, that's going to wrap up for today, folks. But anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. If so, smash the button, feel free to down below. If you share, so please be my guest. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, then please consider. But for to do, hope you're nice day. But for now, it's be Farmer Evo Extreme, and I'll see you all very soon.